Okay, guys, so the fashion show is coming up really soon. It's actually on Thursday. And I wanted to give you all just a, a little bit of behind the scenes footage of what's going on to, to actually produce this fashion show. So just sit back and take a ride. Wait, so just sit back and take a look. Oh, that was high. Get close, get close, get close, get close. Okay, pause. It's difficult for the outside to spin if you're already out. You know what I'm saying? That's why when y'all, as soon as y'all pass this group, the single file, y'all gotta get close almost to the point where you're brushing shoulders to the next person. So that way, if you're close to the center, you have room to spin. Of course, you have more room to spin, but for the purpose of what we're working with, Make sure y'all are very close, okay? Let's start over. I'm working with a really talented makeup artist by the name of Fadat. I don't know her last name, but it's, I know her name is Fadat. So we actually had a meeting where we actually decided what we wanted to do in terms of the makeup for the show. Oh man, when I tell you it's phenomenal, it's phenomenal. Let's take a look. I was thinking more of like a dark, like dark rich colors of like different types of smoky eyes. Um, like a design almost. Okay, so I was thinking something more along the lines of um, a, a base look where we can always make changes to it. Uh, because with the show having so many different levels of intensity, we don't want to come out with them being like super bold and then, you know, so you have to soften it up and then intent, make it more intense, you know what I'm saying? We have a really great team of wardrobe stylists who actually were in control of the design element of the fashion show. They styled the, uh, the, the models, they made the masks that were associated with, you know, the masquerade theme. They did a really great job, so let's see a little bit of something that they've done. I like it, so how do you feel Go get them. They're in that drawer. Like if you walk in the kitchen in the MCC, it's a I see it though. I like it. I do. I it's like bad. it. That's bad. This is a layer. She gotta throw the scarf on, but she can find okay, it. Okay. Cool. Cool. And this is the first one. I like that. In her dress, we did all of them, but her um applied dress, her friend had it. I like the vest on you. This, I think you could definitely do on chest. Okay. You mean like a vest? Like, like I like that. Like that. I do. Now don't think that everything is all peaches and cream. I'm dealing with, with college women and when I tell you it gets pretty hectic, it gets hectic and this isn't even anything to really show you the magnitude of how crazy things get. But let's just take a look behind the scenes to see what happened. Some of them got this funky attitude. They give me looks, but I know it's because I'm the bone. So. Hey, I had a test, I found out that I failed it. So me and D. Carey, we went to go study. And after we studied, we went to the cafeteria to go get something to eat, you know, get some to-go boxes. Practice already started. And then when we got there, Ashley was there, and she thought, I don't know what she thought, but we was getting our to-go boxes, and she's like, yeah, y'all are late to practice, and we're kind of like, huh, we know, we're on our way. People need to be dedicated. If you're not dedicated, then I don't know why you came to the tryouts. You gotta be here, period, so you know what's going on, so you can learn. But you know who you are. Uh huh. But you know, they give you a couple funny looks if they don't know you first. Mm -hmm. So I try to let it brush off. They just hate you. All right, that's what's up. Starting over and starting over and over and over. And I'm like, okay, if we're going to get this, we need to get it down pat so everybody can be on one accord. But it's not working like that. So I'm getting a little pissed off. Now, for all of y'all who don't know, I always tie a theme into the fashion show. That's the way they started, and that's the way I like to continue. And this year's theme is domestic abuse. And so I have two really talented actors, one Alicia, the other one is Ashton, who really do a really great job of actually pulling in this concept, and, and, and they're able to portray it out to the audience. So let's take a look at what they did in the studio. Give me the gun. Just stop. Give me the gun. <laughs> Give me the gun. Didn't no. I tell you, are you gonna shoot me? No. You gonna shoot me? No. Give me the gun. Give me the gun. No. Come on. Give me the gun. 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 Give me the
Come here. I said, give me the no. gun. Denise, give no. me the gun. Let no. it go. No. Let it go. No. Let it go, Denise. Good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the sound down because it's not like it's, like it's a little bit of overmodulation. Mm -hmm. And so I'm going to cut the sound down just a little bit. So I'm going to need for y'all to kind of come up a little bit. And I can always make you louder. Okay. So just keep that same intensity, but I I'll just take, take care of the rest in um, the studio, what well, in here. So you want us to take it from the... Yeah, give it to me from the beginning. I think y'all y'all have a... It, it'll mesh really well now. Okay. Now, some people say I can get a little bit to the side, but I just say it's all in the name of the fashion show. But really, honestly, I don't see it. But maybe you can. I don't know what to say. It's no words to really describe him. No I words. Feel. He's just he's, undescribable. Basically. I mean, when you first meet him, mm -hmm. he's really nice. But mm -hmm. then once you, you get kinda, to know him, once you get in there, because the first time I went to that Think Green practice, he was just like, you're walking wrong, you're doing this wrong. I was like, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. that first day, he doesn't play. Yeah. Raphael, honestly, Raphael. honest to God, he scares me. He just scares me. He just scares me. <laughs> okay, let's start off, everybody. Okay, we're gonna start over. Okay, let's start over. Okay, let's start over. Guess what, I'm here. This is a sacrifice. Where's Ashley? She's not here tonight. She, you know, made a whole big situation about something that happened earlier today, so I'm just like, really? If you're a leader, you need to stand up and be a leader. And that's all I have to say about it. Raphael is cool. Raphael's mad. He's yelling at them. They in trouble. Yeah, I'm showing what you're supposed to be doing while you should be rehearsing. You're yeah, over here eating. And oh, look at that. Pepperoni pizza. Two days, three days before the show. And he's slim. You have to get in the gym to get that off. I'll be there. What you got to say about that? That's like what? 100 cal, I mean, 700 calories in one slice. You'll see it, so I'll be straight. All right, they gonna see. Uh, I don't know what day it is, but pretty far along. Uh, I'm not even really nervous. I'm more uh, just ready to get over with. <laughs> uh, yeah, I can't wait. You know, I'm excited a little bit. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna mess up or nothing like that. I'm just ready for the day. You know, it's supposed to be everybody there. So I'm ready for that. And then I'm ready for the party afterwards. But uh show is on Thursday. Woo! I'm excited. The nerves haven't kicked in yet. That's my partner being retarded. That's my partner. Look at what I'm working with. <laughs> Why are you watching me? <laughs> No, but the nerves haven't kicked in yet. I'm really excited. I'm worried about the hair because normally I have a bob. No more bobs. But now he's doing something really, really short. I think like Nini from Housewives of Atlanta. So I don't know how that's going to turn out, but I'm working anyway because I am fierce and beautiful. You said I got my diva hair on today. <laughs> ba ba boo, baby. Ow. <laughs> how you doing? I'm ready for it. I'm ready for my big hair instead of this flat stuff. But um, I'm all right, you know, so I keep it gangster. Okay, so I'm gonna sleep, so uh, can you hear me? Hello? Hey, I'm out. I think I'm more nervous because people was like, people was like, they would scream your name. I think that's awesome. But scream my name, baby, scream it. Say DC up in the house or say D Carey or say Raquel or say Alicia or say all of them and I'm excited to do this and peace out because you need to be watching the show. What you've seen in just like a couple of minutes is nothing compared to the countless hours that we've all put into this show. We've been working hard for about five weeks and it's crunch time so if you want to see the best show that SFA has seen in terms of fashion come out to the Grand Ballroom, 7 o'clock, 6.55. Actually, be there early to get a good seat because it's going to be packed, I promise you. Crazy hair, crazy makeup. Oh, the makeup is hot. I'm telling you, the makeup is off the chain. The hair is going to be crazy. The models are rocking it. I mean, it's going to be great. So come out. Come out. You don't want to miss it, okay? Come, come out. Oh, no, domestic abuse, no. No, don't do that. Don't do that. All right, see you there.